one feeling that I've been having over the six month period that we spent recording albums. There's no way this is going to work. Or, if only I get it my way, it's going to work. <laughs> if only I get, get the last say, it's going to work. But I have to struggle with this guy. Who's obviously so wrong. Who's obviously wrong. <laughs> and, uh, so it's not going to work. And when you listen to the uh, finished album, I'm very happy with it. It's, uh, it worked out in the end. So it did. Mm. And I noticed, I saw a little bit of footage of you in the studio and you were talking to what I presume, presume was Dave. You said you got the ponytail. Davide, yeah. Yeah. Davide, yeah. It's um, Italian. Oh, Italian, okay. Yeah. And uh, I was going to see how he fitted in because there seemed to be a little bit of conflict, nothing nasty, but a little bit of. Okay, well, you want to, he was saying, Let's, I think we should do it like this. Yeah. And you were sort of like, well, you know, you're the boss, you, and you two do now, so. Yeah. How did it all work out between there the was three a, of you? I mean, there was a lot of uh, conflict, and Davide, he, he chose to stay neutral. He tried to stay neutral as much as he could. And, uh, and I, I often ended up asking Davide, because me and Owen, we would never agree, no matter how much we would discuss the matter. and then. Was, I often said, okay, Davide, what do you think? You have to solve this. So we won't agree. But he did, he wasn't so keen on having the last say. So the thing is, the, the thing is that he, he mostly he agreed with me and he didn't want to hurt you. Yeah, sometimes. <laughs> that's true. Were there more disagreements on the making of this album than on Quiet? Yeah, I think so. I think it was more or less the same. Did, did we argue that much last time? I don't think so. <laughs> Our egos have grown since <laughs> this time. Really? So that makes it even more difficult. Uh, actually, this song is actually written by Eric. And I think he's written it about my superficial um, connections with people that I meet. Is that how you see it, Eric? see it as an observation of many different situations that I've been in. For example? For example, early on. <laughs> right. <laughs> Two doors away, yeah. we'll try it yeah. at some point. Yeah, and the reason why there, there are so many other instruments on this album is because we were recording inside a symphony, a classical uh, concert hall. So there were a lot of musicians around in the, right. in the, in the from the beginning. So we were okay. inviting people into the studio. Oh, you and me alone. Feist person. Who, who's she? It's a <laughs> Feist person. Feist is a Canadian uh, artist. A girl who lives in Paris. A girl with a fantastic voice. She got invited by us and uh, we had heard her demo which uh, sounded uh, really amazing. Which I've been listening to for one and a half years. So we decided to invite her. Okay, Brighton and an Empty Street. Um, any significance in that title, or is that, is that I, I haven't heard the album. I've only heard the single. So it's taken out of the blue. The title. It has absolutely. Random. It has absolutely no meaning. Is that how you made the first title? The first album. Mm. Oh, it's yeah. lying. Yeah. Yes. Nobody else. It's lying. <laughs> what does you pretend? Ain't nobody good to me. Did you know Jimmy Nail? Nail? Yeah. She's lying. The great thing. How do you feel about 
bit about planning Asking's convenience for the first time in some time. We'll see how it works out. We'll probably feel very happy if it works out. Are you nervous? Yeah, yeah we are actually quite nervous. I think it's quite uncertain how it's going to go. Yeah. It's okay when we were just we were just playing now with just doing some radio sessions and that that's okay, but that's in a very controlled environment. And it's never it's never easy to to perform live with acoustic instruments. It's um it's a shame because you can never really get that the same sound as you have when you if if you were just listening to us now playing to you. What you hear on the album is a 45 minute summing up of three years of uh, work. So it's kind of it's hard to sum up that again into a sentence of, yeah. of 25 words. Yeah, and it's yeah. I, I, I have one coming up. Glacier meets Osanova. And starting to melt. Hey! 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 Hey!